first preliminary match of the night, ladies and gentlemen, Gene Bino Gregory. His opponents, Peter Placido. Welcome to the Blaze Dell Arena X1 Battlegrounds. We've got two preliminary matches going on. Uh, before we bring you to the actual Battlegrounds 4, we've got two fighters. Who do we got in the ring right now? Peter Placido from uh, Bulls Pen versus Gene Beano Gregory from Mixed Breed. Now, what do you know about these two fighters? Um, Gene Gregory comes in with a 0-1 pro record, but he did win um, his first amateur fight. It's always great. It's always great to watch. Uh, I mean, these guys. Is this their? Uh, they get a lot of experience so far. These two kind of up-and-coming fighters. Uh, yeah. Fortunately, his loss. Gene Gregory's loss was against uh, a stud in Marcus Show. We're going to see later on tonight. Mm -hmm. And of course, always great to see, uh, not necessarily new fighters, but up-and-coming fighters because a lot of times they have nothing, you know, nothing to lose but everything to prove. Exactly, and they come out balls out and see yeah. I mean, they will, they will try everything they've learned from, from striking to submission to... All right, welcome to the Blaze Zell Arena right here in Honolulu, Hawaii. We have uh, the X1 Battlegrounds 4. My name is McCunny. I'll be sitting in next to my good friend. Mike Anzuka here. And me and Mike will be uh, taking you through uh, X1 Battlegrounds 4. We've got a lot of great fighters actually in the lineup. Yeah, great matches coming up. Uh, Mark Moreno's fighting Eddie Yagen, who's kind of coming back from a little layoff there, um, kind of staying busy. Marco Shiro, uh, Bryson Kamaku actually just fought last night. Incredible. Unreal. So, I mean, already we're in this, uh, our first round. It's a preliminary match. Two new fighters, up and coming fighters. But like I said earlier, you got to love it because these guys will go uh, just balls out and, and uh, try everything they possibly can and they learn. <laughs> just pounding. Full pounding position here. <laughs> It's always got to be a good thing to be, you know, up and coming fighter. You just, and a lot of times what's hard is, uh, is they want to go so 100%. Sometimes they'll, they'll get tired, but these guys look like they're in shape. Yeah, definitely. Great, great share of both guys. They've been going kind of hard for the whole mm -hmm. round here. And, um, you know, so they still got a lot left in their gas tank. Scheduled for uh, how many minute rounds in this preliminary? We have two three minute rounds, and this is the 155 pound weight class amateur MMA bout again. Great positioning here on top. Nice mount. Again, X1 World Events putting together a, a great lineup of uh, the world's top mixed martial artists and, of course, a lot of the fighters out of Hawaii. End of our first round. So understand that uh, at last check, I heard I heard a rumor that per capita, Hawaii Hawaii fans, uh, mixed martial arts fans, uh, love. It's Hawaii fighters at the per capita. There's more, more fans that love mixed martial arts uh, than anywhere else. Oh, definitely. We have so much events now here. This is turning into the Mecca. Um, probably more consistent than even California. where mm -hmm. um, They've been kind of getting a lot of good shows. Vegas, of course, UFC kind of dominates that. But um, Hawaii, as far as, you know, amount of fighters for how much people we have exactly. here. Exactly. Insane. It's, it's, you, you always hear the buzz on the street if, the, if there's an upcoming event, an upcoming fight. Uh, Hawaii fans, of course, always going to show up. And of course, we've got Peter Placido in the uh, black trunks. And Gene Bino Gregory in the uh, navy blue. Going right into their second round. Of course, the first one, you can tell they felt each other out. They kind of know what's going on, so now they kind of... See what else can happen. Yeah, we'll see what they um, start testing their stand-up here. Oh, nice, nice right hand there, sneaks in. <laughs> Both players kind of measuring their distance here. First one, they kind of went balls out. They got a good test. They pretty much well matched as far as upper body clinching. Um, you know, they had a lot of ground work there, but. Uh, I'm 
Hopefully they continue to pull him out. Ready to grab, just pound and pound. Kind of held this whole, the majority of the first round in the same position here. Mm -hmm. Excellent mount. If you don't have a hard time getting away and getting uh, out of this mount, he basically had no answer getting out of this mount. So we'll see how long he can last here. A lot of time left. It was an arm bar attempt. A little sloppy. Couldn't, couldn't finish it off. Nice takedown again. Nice. Versus a little guillotine here. Got a guillotine going. That ten finger guillotine. She has to drop the shoulder. Shoulder drop, nice and pretty I mean, solid. All they need to do is like use it legs, keep pressure. Just the the cranking of the neck again. Not only the uh, the submission of, of the the throat, but just the neck the muscles <laughs> training. The neck right just there. training. It's it's one of the two. It's one of those moves that. Yeah, the problem is that this this ten finger guillotine all depends on your grip. So if you have the wrong grip, you have basically no pressure on the guy's neck. And so, uh, Gene uh, Gregory would he'd actually be uh, using more of his energy trying to hold it. Exactly, exactly. And you can kind of see it was, it was too calm. Mm. So that kind of tells me he didn't have the correct grip. He had mm. the normal guillotine grip, which is not good for that ten finger guillotine. Which is the you know hands inside. Oh, uh, going for the body. No, was no. trying to pan back here. Excellent first fight. I mean, if, if this is uh, the uh, what we're going to witness throughout the night, X1 World Events, this is the Battlegrounds 4, our preliminary fight. We've got a couple of them. This is our first one coming by way of the 155 pound weight class. So it's just to the end of that. Uh, Here's that guillotine right there, locked in. It does look like he had just a normal grip. You know, kind of get a little peek of the the um, the grip right there. You have to modify that grip, and he's putting strain in the neck. But what happens is he just kind of torques the neck backwards. How about a round of applause for these two fighters, ladies and gentlemen? Preliminary match. Welcome to X1 Battlegrounds. Our first fight of the night. If this is set precedence for the fights tonight, man, I'm going to find out. All right, another round of applause. These fighters. Our first fight of the night. X1 Battlegrounds. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause. For our winner tonight, by unanimous decision, out of the blue corner, Peter Placido.